The horses have reached the starting point and they're loading into the gates. The first two in, number nine, Mom's Extravagant Heart, and number six, Queen's Award. Going in now from the inside, number two, Perry Funny Stephen. Number eight, Bodacious Miracles is in. Number three, Carlos the Second. The favorite is number seven, Shake It Twice, one of two in the field for Bourgeois. Number four, Usain Colt. Two horses left to load. One from the inside stall is number one, Tray on Fire, and one from the outside stall, number 10, A Fancy Arrangement, here in the Ontario Sire Stakes Derby. They're at the post. And they're off. Oh, quickly in the center was Usain Colt. Away quickly now. It's Shake It Twice. And towards the inside, Perry Funny Stephen. Shake It Twice. Usain Colt. Perry Funny Stephen. Late close on the extreme outside by a Mom's Extravagant Heart. Shake It Twice is going to fend off Stablemate. Mom's Extravagant Heart. Chantal Bourgeois. 1 2 in the Ontario Sire Stakes Derby. The unofficial winner of the Ontario Sire Stakes Derby is number seven, Shake It Twice. Finishing second, stablemate number nine, Mom's Extravagant Heart. Third was number two, Perry Funny Stephen. And fourth, number four, Usain Colt. Attention, ladies and gentlemen, hold on to all tickets, please. The stewards have an inquiry regarding the start. So we have a steward's inquiry. Hold on to all tickets, please, until the seventh race has been posted official. The race will be reviewed by the stewards regarding the start.
Ladies and gentlemen, after a review of the video, the stewards have determined that all horses had a fair start. There will be no change in the order of finish. We will go with the numbers on the board. 7924 will become official momentarily. The results of the seventh race are now official. The winner of the Ontario Sires Stakes Derby, number seven, Shake It Twice. Three-year-old Sorrow Philly by Look at Magic Sporm out of Shake Pretty Baby by Pretty Boy Perry. Bred, owned, and trained by Chantal Bourgeois, Shake It Twice was ridden to victory by jockey Corey Spataro with a time of 17.94 seconds, carrying a speed index of 89. Second was Stablemate, number nine, Mom's Extravagant Heart, Third, number two, Perry Funny Stephen, and fourth, number four, Usain Colt. Here now are your total results of the seventh race from top to bottom in your programs. Number one, Trey on Fire finished eighth with a time of 18.41 seconds. Number two, Perry Funny Stephen was third with a time of 18.08 seconds. Number three, Carlos the second was seventh with a time of 18.40 seconds. Number four, Usain Colt finished fourth with a time of 18.31 seconds. Number five, Legacy of the Moon was a vet scratch. Number six, Queen's Award finished fifth with a time of 18.34 seconds. Number seven, Shake It Twice, the race winner with a time of 17.94 seconds. Number eight, Bodacious Miracles was ninth with a time of 18.75 seconds. Number nine, Mom's Extravagant Heart finished second with a time of 17.96 seconds. And number 10, A Fancy Arrangement was sixth with a time of 18.34 seconds. Rechecking from top to bottom, order of finish in your program should read 837, 4 Vet Scratch, 51926. Those are the total results of the seventh race. In this upcoming eighth race, just an owner correction on number one, I'll be gone a jet. The owner is Natalie Catania. Race eight is the first half of the late daily double. <laughs> well, Team Purple is here. Look at this. We got the purple. Well, Ben, I don't know. Better. Shake It Twice has won the Ontario Sire Stakes Derby, $56,000 stake for owner, trainer, breeder, and Mrs. Purple all around, Chantelle Bourgeois and her family here, husband Dean Link, daughter Emily, and son Ben. Jockey Corey Spataro, and wow, what an exciting race because I can't even imagine. We'll, we'll get to Chantel's feelings, but her maiden horse almost caught you there. So she ran one too, but Corey, tell me about this amazing filly. This is her third win and five starts this year. Um, was it a hard race to win? How did it go the trip? Uh, she, I thought she was uh, one of the best ones in the race. Uh, she probably broke the best she's ever done for me this year. Um, I think that's actually what sealed the deal for the win for us is that, uh, you know, she was able to leave there uh, really, really well today with no, uh, no interruptions. Uh, so, you know, I did hear TP coming. He's been on fire today. So, uh, you know, anytime you hear him, you always kind of get a little nervous there. But uh, I, I knew we, uh, I was pretty positive that uh, we wouldn't get there before he can reach us. So she's a pretty gritty filly and uh, a lot of good things to come. Wow, she looks like she's just getting better. And this was her first time going this distance of 350. Uh, does she have any distance limitations? Uh, no, you know, she, she's very smart how she runs. She's always starting off uh, on her left lead. And then, you know, when she starts to get tired, she swaps to her right lead. And then she kind of gives me like that little extra spurt. So the longer distance uh, it would definitely be no problem for her. Well, big, big win, Corey. Congratulations. Uh, nice filly. It's going to be exciting to watch her the rest of the season. Congrats. Thank you very much. The gang is here. 
Congratulations, Chantel. This has got to be, I mean, I know when your 96-year-old grand, uh, grandmother, aunt was here uh, for her last win, but a big win here in the Ontario Sire Stakes Derby, and your boy, bred by your husband, almost beat the filly. What do you think about that finish? We were actually pretty worried about him taking the princess's crown because he's, yeah, but she was very sharp today. We had a lot of confidence in her, and I knew he was an up-and-comer, and pretty exciting year going on here it's a very exciting year i have no words for this race but i really do have to thank cassandra who did so much work with both of these horses um that ran first and second today corey an awesome ride tony three great rides on mom's extravagant heart it's it's a team um melissa of course who went back to the barn with the horse it's it's been a phenomenal year i'm so grateful well, it's really fun to see you guys because you're a lot of fun. Dean, your horse that you bred runs second, and it uh, won't be long before he wins his maiden. Seems that way. Sooner or later, he's got to win, right? <laughs> <laughs> All the maids will be gone eventually. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, I mean, sh oh, your son's laughing. He thinks that's funny. Ben, do you think that's funny? <laughs> I'm, I'm fighting. Yeah, wait, what? I don't know. I think he said he was on fire or something. <laughs> Anyways, well, congratulations to the bourgeois, Link family, gang, mom and dad here. Congratulations. Big win by Shake It Twice. Uh, where are we going to see her next? Uh, she's going to have a little break. Shoes are coming off. She's going out for a little romp, and she'll be back for the next derby. All right. Well, congrats again. Enjoy the one-two finish. Thank you. We'll see you guys coming up for the next race. Hi, I'm Dave Duvall with your track tip. How do I read the racing program? Well, the first